Yeah, this is truly a team effort that spanned across the country involving multiple agencies to make sure that Dignity Health here, the medical professionals on the front line, are able to get gowns, and they're making 20,000 of them. Thousands of yards of fabric getting prepped, smoothed out, and ready to be made into this, a specialized gown for medical professionals on the front lines in Arizona. This is the, to the healthcare worker now, this is the body armor for the soldier. Dr. Ronald Galliano, a Dignity Health surgeon, came up with this design only four weeks ago. It's unique with its highly durable fabric and can withstand more than 100 washes. The disposable gowns, if you can even find them, it's actually more cost effective than our current disposable gowns. It's more protective. This fabric needed to make this PPE was located across the country. With the amount needed, 7,000 pounds, the Arizona National Guard was enlisted. To go out and back, they did that mission in 10 hours and 38 minutes. Took off from here, flew to North Carolina, loaded over 50,000 yards of fabric. After landing at Sky Harbor, the National Guard dropped it off here at Fabric, a fashion incubator in Tempe, now turned to PPE designers, answering the call to help those on the front lines. We're gearing up with more machines. In fact, there's a shipment of uh, more sewing machines. We've added 14 already. Pretty cool. So that fabric in Tempe, they said they can make 500 gowns in an eight-hour period, and they say those gowns will be in hospitals by the end of the week.